unfortunately I've got very bad memories of the 2005 game. It was uh, didn't end the way I wanted it to end. I'm sure you've got very different memories <laughs> of those ones, mate. A little bit, yeah. I think it was a really tough tough challenge for us coming in um, that week and we knew that Geelong were going to put up an almighty effort. I think um, it was close all night long and obviously Lingy and I played against each other for the, for the whole four quarters of that game. And um, you know, as it turned out, it was one player that really just turned the game in that last quarter and we all know who that was, Nick Davis, who just you know, kicked four goals from absolutely nowhere. Bloody Nick Davis, Nick though. Davis. <laughs> Oh, I think without question the toughest opponent I've ever had playing in Sydney is this bloke here and I'm not just saying it because he's standing <laughs> next to me. Slip me that 50 later yeah, on. Yeah, but, um, no, fantastic footballer and just so hard to beat and so dangerous in all parts of the ground. Um, played against Darren Creswell a couple of times and uh, he was very hard to play against but yeah, the man next to me certainly gets the nod. Yeah, look, I think um, Geelong have got they're such a fantastic team and um, obviously playing against them and knowing that Cameron's going to come to me. Um, you're never just playing against um, Lingy when uh, you play against the Cats and I think his voice to, you know, when I did get him on the spread, that his other teammates would support him very well and I think that's what, um, you know, we value ourselves at, at the Swans as being a, a team and I think Geelong have definitely um, got to that level and they especially did that when um, we played against each other because um, it wasn't just Lingy that would, would, would be picking me up, it was a whole 22-man um, game plan to, to stop each individual out there.